Hey, I'm Stephen and this is Solving the Money Problem. If you're new, welcome. If you're not, welcome back. And for regular viewers of the channel, yes, I'm out of my 14-day hotel prison at last. Freedom. Well, unless I want to leave the country, which is currently a criminal offence, with a penalty of up to five years in prison and a gigantic fine. So other than living in a semi-fascist country, it's good to be back. In this video, we're discussing Tesla's Plaid Model S. Delivery has commenced in a couple of months, and we've just learned that the Plaid Model S has broken the record for the fastest ever quarter mile time for a production vehicle. So let's get into the video. And by the way, since I know there's a lot of crypto lovers watching and people who like free stuff, it's your lucky day. For a limited time, you can get up to $250 in free crypto bonuses when funding a new account on BlockFi, where you can use cryptocurrency to earn interest, borrow cash, and buy or sell crypto. If you want your free crypto, use the link in the description. It also helps out the channel. And if you'd like up to two free stocks, check out the link in the description to Weeble. If you open a new account, you'll get one free stock valued up to $250 just for opening an account. And if you fund your account with $100, you'll get a second free stock valued up to $1,600. Unless you don't like free stocks, that is. And if you're in Australia, the UK, or New Zealand, you can get a free stock with stake also using the link in the description. Let's get back to it. So here we are over on the Drive Tesla Canada website. I quote, Tesla Model S Plaid sets new record for fastest quarter mile time of any production car. Tesla has set a new official record for the fastest quarter mile time of any production car in their Model S Plaid. The time was set on 11th of May 2021. According to a source who was at the event, the Midnight Silver Model S Plaid set an official time of 9.23 seconds with a trap speed of 152.16 miles per hour. 244 kilometers an hour absolutely insane just take a moment to think about that sure 9.23 seconds sounds fast but guys think about taking 9.23 seconds to get to a speed of 150 plus miles an hour almost 250 kilometers per hour this is absolutely insane that handily beats the previous record of 9.4 seconds held by the Bugatti Chiron Sport at a base price of 3.2 million US dollars. The supercar is considerably more expensive than the Model S Plaid, which starts at 120,000 US dollars. So let's just take a moment to let the implications of this sink in. You see this thing? It's called a calculator. Watch this. 3.2 million dollars divided by $120,000 equals you could buy 26 and a half Tesla Plaid Model S's for the price of one Bugatti Chiron. Tesla is swinging around their gigantic engineering capabilities and this is the final hammer blow to the internal combustion engine vehicle. Tesla has effectively laid a gigantic cable over the entire ICE industry. Just imagine being a company who specializes in creating performance internal combustion engine vehicles. Tesla is now effectively giving you the double bird and you are screwed. The truth is, most consumers out there don't want the fastest ever vehicle, nor do they have the resources to buy it. But just imagine a vehicle priced at around $120,000 outperforming multi-million dollar hypercars. This is absurd. Breaking records is a brilliant marketing strategy. So much attention is going to be on this record now. Of course, most consumers do not care. But that subset of people that just want the fastest possible car, either because they love going fast, or because they're vertically challenged, or because they're horizontally challenged in the meat club department and hope that this fast vehicle will add a few inches. Unfortunately, it won't. But hey, guys, whatever floats your boat, this is the vehicle to own now. The time set by the four-door electric sedan is also nearly a full half second quicker than the second fastest car on the list the Porsche 918 Spyder. Record lines up almost exactly with Tesla's targeted time and speed that has been on the website since the variant was announced earlier this year. Plaid upgrades included, quickest accelerating car in production today. Well, that is confirmed. Zero to 100 kilometers per hour in 2.1 seconds. Quarter mile time, 9.23 seconds at 250 kilometers per hour trap speed. 1,020 horsepower, the Plaid Model S quarter mile time is also quicker than the time Lucid set in their Air Trimoto prototype last year. RIP Lucid. There is one important difference. Lucid's time of 9.245 seconds was achieved in a completely stripped down version of the Air, whereas the Model S Plaid had a full interior. <laughs> Again, just please let that sink in. I mean... This is like a four-door family sedan that is breaking records <laughs> versus like supercars. I mean, literally, you're talking here, Bugatti Chiron, Porsche 918 Spyder, McLaren P1, all of these specifically designed for speed and nothing else. The Tesla Model S is a legitimate four-door family sedan that just so happens to be the fastest fucking production car on planet Earth. 
And here's an interesting tidbit. Our source also told us that it wasn't just Tesla employees at the track, but late night comedian and car enthusiast Jay Leno was in attendance to film the testing session for his show, Jay Leno's Garage. Just wait until Jay Leno features the Model S Plaid's record-breaking quarter mile time to his audience of millions. Not only was Leno watching, he also got behind the wheel. According to our source, he was able to lay down a time of 9.5 seconds with the added weight of two passengers in the car during his run. <laughs> what even is this? And there's even more. Some footage has emerged of a Tesla Model S Plaid, potentially Model S Plaid Plus, testing and trying to break some lap records at Laguna Seca Raceway as well. Unconfirmed reports of a lap time of around 1 minute and 30 seconds. Obviously a developing story and we can see some footage here. We can also see some shots of the Model S Plaid in motion, flying around the track. And interestingly, check out the rear spoiler as well. We can see that this seems to be able to move up and down as well. Pretty epic. And there wasn't just one Tesla Plaid. So maybe there's a Plaid and a Plaid Plus. Maybe these are both just Plaid. Maybe they're both Plaid Plus. I don't actually know. But multiple Teslas currently or very recently attempting to set lap record times at Laguna Seca Raceway. This is really big news. Here we are on the Tesla official website looking at the Plaid Model S deliveries around August, September sometime this year. The Plaid Model S priced just under $120,000. Now check out the feature details. We'll compare the Plaid to the Plaid Plus. So as we saw, 0 to 60 time of 1.99 seconds, quarter mile time 9.23 seconds, 155 mile per hour trap speed, and 1,020 horsepower. <laughs> and then there's Plaid Plus. Now remember, the Plaid has already set the record quarter mile time for any production car ever, and the Plaid Plus is even quicker. The 0 to 60 time here is listed as simply less than 1.99 seconds. Tesla not really giving away a lot here. The quarter mile time, less than 9 seconds, which is actually giving a lot away, and 1,100 plus horsepower. The Model S Plaid expected delivery time is mid-2022, almost a year after Plaid Model S deliveries begin. It'll feature the 4680 cell, and I'm sure the absolute latest technology from Tesla. So here's how things will play out. In a few months, Tesla begins shipping the world's fastest ever production vehicle, which just so happens to be a four-door family sedan. What the actual? Then, supercar makers, hypercar makers, whether it's internal combustion, electric, or a combination thereof, all attempt to chase down Tesla's record. Meanwhile, Tesla continues development on, then begins production of the Plaid Plus, which drops almost a year later and then shatters those very records. And if you thought Tesla was done there, no fucking chance. After that drops the Tesla Roadster. Per Tesla's website, currently listed with a 1.9 second 0 to 60 time, a 620 mile range, absolutely bananas performance. And by the way, also seats four people. Well, two adults and two rather small people, also known as children. The specs we're looking at here, this is for the base model, I have to add. <laughs> There's also the model with the SpaceX package, which literally has cold gas thrusters to help with acceleration, handling, all sorts of other stuff as well. But just the base model, 0 to 60 time, 1.9 seconds, quarter mile time of 8.8 .8 seconds, top speed of over 250 miles per hour, seats for, base price $200,000, absolutely nuts. Now I suspect that the SpaceX package with the cold gas thrusters is going to dramatically decrease the roads to zero to 60 time. Now I don't have any inside information, but my best guess is that the zero to 60 time on the Tesla Roadster with the cold gas thruster package is gonna be in the mid to low one second range. And if so, I mean, it's game over. How many other automotive manufacturers would even have access to space technology, to cold gas thrusters to use on their own vehicles to try to catch up? I mean, it's just game over. This will be Tesla's record for years to come, if not indefinitely. Tesla once again are playing 4D chess, this time in terms of completely melting the ice age and destroying the internal combustion engine vehicle, including high performance for good. Electric is the future and nobody can argue with this. Tesla has lined up a violent, brutal four punch combo that is going to absolutely shatter, destroy and embarrass the entire internal combustion engine vehicle industry. First comes the Plaid, shattering records, fastest ever production vehicle in terms of quarter mile time ever. 
Then, less than a year later, comes the Plaid Plus. Then comes the Tesla Roadster. And then the Tesla Roadster with the cold gas thruster package from SpaceX. They say a picture is worth a thousand words, so I'm just going to shut up and let you guys enjoy the show. I think this sums things up perfectly. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below if you're interested in buying a Tesla Model S Plaid or Plaid Plus or the Tesla Roadster. And also, what do you think? Is Tesla strategically trying to just lay out punch after punch after punch after punch over the next 12 to 24 months to absolutely shit all over the internal combustion engine? I'm Stephen Mark Ryan. This is Solving the Money Problem, and I love you all. And don't forget, if you'd like up to $250 in free crypto bonuses with BlockFi, use the link in the description. You can also get two free stocks with Webull and a free stock with Stake also linked in the description. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And of course, if you have any ideas for future videos, let me know. I read all your comments. P.S. If you're still watching, you're awesome. If you'd like early access, exclusive videos, regular Q&As, our private Discord server and more, consider supporting the channel at patreon.com slash solving the money problem so I can keep creating content for you guys. There's a link in the description. You can now also become a member of the channel for some exclusive perks. To learn more, click the join button next to subscribe. And don't forget to check out our merch store. Either way, the best form of support is you being here and watching, so thanks again.